is it true that Michael Jackson was aware of uh, of Scott Peterson and um, Mark Eragos's uh, lack of uh, of uh, winning and whatnot? Well, when, when I met Michael Jackson in Florida and he asked me to take over the case, uh, he told me he thought Mark Aragos was way over his head in Michael Jackson's case. He said he's really not competent to win this thing, is what he told me. And he also commented that he thought Mr. Garagos was over his head in the Scott Peterson case. And Michael turned out to be correct in both. Fortunately so for Michael, on the record, he got... Re- huh? On the record... Um, Mark Garagos never walked off the Michael Jackson case. He was fired, right? Yes, I was there when uh, the decision was made. I was there when he was called on the phone. And, uh, you know, we, we tried to make it look as as decently as we could, trying to hurt Mr. Garagos. But the reality is Michael Jackson fired him. Um, and uh, Mark Garagos uh, continued to try and get back in the case according to my sources, one of which was Randy Jackson, who kept telling me that uh, Michael, that Garagos constantly is lobbying his mother and others to try and get back in the case and being very critical of me. So the answer is he did not voluntarily walk off the case. That's, that's not true. We, we, right. were, we, were co- we, were co- we were cooperative in trying to send a message that he was too busy with Peterson and that's why he was leaving the case, but that was just a way to be nice to Mr. Garagos. 